This remarkably unusual hole is the deepest hole on Earth. As evident from its appearance, this hole is actually a man-made artificial borehole. Its depth alone reaches an astonishing 12 kilometers. It can be said that it is even deeper than the Mariana Trench, the deepest part of the Earth's oceans. What did scientists in the past discover in this now sealed, deep hole? This hole, located deep in the western part of Russia, is the deepest hole ever dug by humanity. The formal name of this hole is the Kola Super Deep Borehole. Although it is named a borehole, it is not actually related to the extraction of fuel or any other resources. In that case, who dug this deep hole, and with what purpose? Indeed, this hole was drilled by scientists to study the Earth's crust. This project was conducted for approximately 24 years, from 1970 to 1994. The initial goal was to drill down to a depth of 15 kilometers into the Earth's crust, but ultimately, it reached a depth of about 12 kilometers. Indeed, when measured from the Earth's surface, it can be considered the deepest hole ever drilled into the Earth. Given that the depth of the Earth's crust is approximately 35 kilometers, we can say that the Kola Super Deep Borehole reached a depth just shy of halfway. What could potentially exist at such profound depths? Scientists made the discovery of fossils of 24 different ancient single-celled organisms at a depth of approximately 7 kilometers. Despite the high temperatures and challenging conditions, these fossils were remarkably well preserved. Furthermore, at a depth of approximately 12 kilometers, water, which theoretically should not exist at such depths, was discovered. Scientists had never anticipated the presence of water at such depths, making it an unexpected discovery. Scientists speculate that hydrogen and oxygen atoms released from compressed rocks under high pressure could have formed water. Furthermore, due to the impermeability of the rock layers, this water was unable to rise to the Earth's surface. Lastly, a substantial amount of hydrogen content was found. This was also an unexpected finding, and due to the hydrogen, the mud flowing out of the borehole entrance was bubbling and boiling. Scientists originally intended to drill to a depth of 15 kilometers, but ultimately ended the project after reaching 12,262 meters. This was because the rock layers at that depth had a temperature of 180 degrees Celsius, much higher than initially expected. Due to the high temperature, the rocks were in a malleable state, resembling melted plastic, rather than being solid. After drilling through these rocks, there were issues with the hole becoming malleable and closing up again once the drill bit was replaced. Ultimately, due to these technical challenges, it was impossible to penetrate and pass through these rock layers. If the drilling had reached the original goal of 15 kilometers, it is estimated that the temperature at that depth would have been around 300 degrees Celsius. Due to issues such as budgetary constraints, the project was ultimately terminated in 2005, and the entrance of the hole was securely welded shut. If the drilling had penetrated through the 12-kilometer rock layers and proceeded deeper, what would have been discovered? Would there have been issues of uncontrollable geological disturbances, as some conspiracy theorists claim? Alternatively, could something completely unexpected have been discovered at that greater depth? Given the advancements in technology since then, it could be meaningful to attempt drilling again and exploring further depths.